Welcome back to another session with The Technologist. Today we're going to show you how to access the information that allows you to see which students in your classes have an early warning based on attendance, discipline, credit issues, or low performance in various curricular areas. Method number one is to go to the SQL Reports page by clicking on this link from your PowerSchool homepage. On this page you will see three options. What you are interested in here are the Power Teacher Reports and then Early Warning Report with Alert Icons for Teachers. In this menu please select Yes so that you only view students who have an EWS alert and click Submit. Now that you're here you will see all of your students who have an EWS alert and depending on how you're viewing this you may need to scroll over to see all of the alerts. Here's where you will see if a student has issues with attendance, with low grades, with low grades in particular uh, areas like English and math, and whether they have a problem with credits and whether they are on time to graduate. If you see the credits icon, they are behind schedule for graduation. In this view, you see all of your students in one long list. We often think in terms of our classes, however. The second way of accessing these reports is to go into your backpack for each particular class. Period 1, I open the backpack, and down at the bottom of this view, in the left-hand column, you will see EWS alerts with icons. That'll take you to the same menu we were just looking at, except I'm only looking at the kids that are in my first hour. So instead of looking at a list that is alphabetical, that includes all of my students, I'm looking only at first hour. Once you're in this view, you can also click on these icons to get specific details. For example, this student has eight period absences. The ELA and math alerts indicate simply that the student has one or more low scores in that curricular area. Clicking on the credit icon will show you how many credits have been earned, how many credits are expected at this point, and the courses where the credit was lost. Both methods will get you access to the information you need to know whether a student already has an issue with attendance or with low grades and will give teachers the opportunity to intervene with more information and with targeted strategies for students who have already demonstrated the need for support. As always, if you need anything further, please don't hesitate to get in touch.